God bless you. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. It doesn't matter the time you were watching. We want to welcome you to this morning service, another tremendous time in the presence of the Lord. The word of the Lord say that in the presence of the Lord there is fullness of joy. In his right hand there are pleasures forevermore. I want to tell you that the Lord has something to say to you today. Very powerful. You are about to be nourished by the presence of God. You are about to be refreshed by his word. But before we go into those things, can you wherever you are lift up your hand and bless his holy name. Father, we thank you because you're a good God and your mercy endure forever. We thank you for your loving kindness that does not cease. They are new every morning and great is your faithfulness. We enter in your gate with thanksgiving. We enter in your court with praise. We are declaring you are amazing God. You are gracious. You are merciful. You are awesome. You are long-suffering. You are faithful. You are all that we need and we ever need. I call you the rose of Sharon. You are the bright and morning star. You are the fairest of 10,000 to our soul. You are the bread we are looking for. You are the air we breathe. You are our way maker. You make a way where there seems to be no way. There is nothing you cannot do. There is no one you cannot bless. We worship you, Lord. We worship you, Lord. We adore you, our God. We reverence you, Jehovah. Wonderful, gracious, and holy. We thank you, Lord. Father, at this time, we declare that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of the Father. Wherever man is found, Jesus is Lord. In your family right now, Jesus is Lord. In your business, Jesus is Lord. In your body, in your spirit, in your soul, in your mind, Jesus is Lord. Over the regions of the earth, Jesus is the Lord. Over the territory where you live, Jesus is Lord. Jesus is Lord over Satan, over demons, over power, over sickness, over poverty. We declare you Jesus, Lord. And then we come by the blood of Jesus Christ against every spirit that want to interfere with this service. We come by the blood of Jesus Christ against every power from the pit of hell that want to interfere with what God has for us. Father, we are willing now to receive from you Holy Spirit. If you don't do it, nothing is done. We trust you, we depend on you, we believe you. Move in our midst as you have already been moving now. Increase the intensity of the fire. That our lives will be refined, remade, reshaped, repositioned. Thank you. Father, as we are entering with praise now, let the words of our mouth and the meditations of our heart be acceptable to you. Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus, I know somebody will be healed today. Somebody will be refreshed. Somebody will be restored tremendously. But before we get into that, can you get yourself for worship? Get yourself for praise. As we usher in the dew of heaven. Hallelujah! Come on, somebody keep raising the sound in this place. You can pray in the Holy Ghost. Come on, do you have heaven? Pray in the Holy Ghost. Pray in the Holy Ghost. Pray in the Holy Ghost. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Ananama Sunday Ananga Dosia Nebasha. Isia Kamanda said Amanda Zegadega Debedesha. Shabba Balanaba Katamanda Bragadonda Shakata. Ikapambre Amanambre Sia Pacombra. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Ayala Baha. 
you are the reason I live you are the one for me you're the one for me I welcome everyone to service this morning you are the reason I live you're the one for uh, you're the very one for me you are say you are the reason I live you're the one for me you're the one for me you're the one for me come on choir say you are the reason you are the reason I live you're the one for me you're the one for me you're the one for me you're the one all right now let's take it up three part harmony say you are the reason you are the reason I live hey, my, 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 my. you're the one for me wherever you are lift up your you're voice the one for me. and let Jehovah know that you are the reason I live you are the reason for You're me. the one for me. No one the one for me. You're the one for me. And why should I fear? I when I have you, I'm surrounded by your capital. Your everlasting love. Why should I care what people say? Why should I care what people say? You mean they to me, don't know but I know what you mean to me. I love what you mean to Say me. you are the reason, yes, you are. You are the reason I live. You're the one, you're the one for oh, me. Me. You're the one for me. I want to tell the world that you are the reason. You are the reason. You are the reason. I you're the very one. You're the one for me. You're the one. You're the one. Say, me. why should I fear? Why should I fear? When, when I, I have you, I am surrounded by your love. Oh, by your love. Your everlasting love. Everlasting love. Why should I care? Why should I care? What people what say? People Yes, sir. And my mouth filled with praise. Ah, I will worship you, God. Oh, ah, God. Oh, all I see is you. Hey, with my hands, with my hands lifted high. Yes, sir. Take it up. I'm not 
I see it's Jesus that I see at the center of it all it's you that I see it's you that I see my God whatever you are say at the center of it all it's you that I see yes sir it's you that I see. Say at the center, at the center of it all. Hey, it's you that I see. Oh, it's you that I see. Yeah. One more time. Say at the center, at the center of it all. Yeah, Baba. It's you that I see. It's you that I see. My God. At the center of it all, say at the center of it all. It's you that I see. It's you that I see. It's you that I see. There is power. There is power in your name. Miracles happen in the name of Jesus. I love this part. Hey, I am told that you are big, bigger than the biggest. You are stronger, stronger than the strongest. You are higher, higher than the highest. You are greater, greater. Everybody, you are big, bigger than the biggest. Hey, you are stronger, stronger than the strongest. You are higher. I see Jesus is you that I see hey 
at the center of my existence it's you that I behold it's you that I see oh Nishé Iyanu you're the God of awesome wonders I tasted of your power Aya. oh Nishé Iyanu you have shown me so much mercy much more than I deserve Oh, Nishé, oh, Nishé, Iyanu, you're the God of awesome wonders, I tasted of your power. Oh, Nishé, oh, Nishé, Iyanu, you have shown me so much mercy, much more than I deserve. Much more than I deserve. Iyanu, Iyanu, Onye, Onisha, Onisha, Iyanu, Iyanu, Onisha, Onisha, Iyanu, Iyanu, Onisha, Onisha, Iyanu, Iyanu. Iyanu, eh, oh, Nishé, say, oh, Nishé, Iyanu, you're the God of awesome wonders, I've tasted of your power, tasted of your power, hey, oh, Nishé, Iyanu, you have shown me so much mercy, much more than I deserve. Much more than I deserve. For your mercies are new every morning. There is no other God who lives and never, never dies. There is no, there is no, oh, there is no other God who lives and never, never Never dies. There is no other God who never fails. All right, now you can jam those hands together for Jesus like this. Come on, brush it up. Let's give Jesus a praise. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. One more time. Let's go. Let's play, play, play for me. Let's go. Jam those hands. Aha. Hallelujah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Na, 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 na. Shed out of the summer. Aya. Oh, oh. Are you with me now? Say. There is no other God who 
sinking sand On Christ the solid rock I stand There is no other God who never fails There is no There is no other God who lives and never, never dies hey. There is no I know, no, 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 no No, not one, oh God who never fails. You reign, you ancient Zion's king. Kadosh, Kadosh, you are mighty on your throne. You reign, you ancient Zion's king. Kadosh, Kadosh, you are mighty on your throne. You reign, say, you Kadosh, Kadosh, you are mighty on your throne. Hey, Bube, you reign, you reign, you reign, you ancient Zion. I'm a mama, see a mama, Kadosh, 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 you are mighty, you are mighty on your Who throne. Who can challenge you? You reign, you reign, you reign, you ancient Zion. Kadosh, Kadosh, you are mighty on your throne. Change that all say. You are the Lord that changes all. All right, play for me. Pam, pam, paddy, the pam. Paddy, the pam, 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 paddy, the pam. Paddy, the pam, pam, paddy, the pam. All right, now, change that for me. I say, You are the Lord that changes all to say. You are the Lord that changes all. Change the naughty You are the Lord that changes not. Hey, change, change, you change that to naughty You are the Lord that changes not. Give a truth for a digger, one with You are the Lord that changes not. Abbas, I dig up one with me. You are the Lord that changes not. When you name it, you change that to naughty You are the Lord that changes not. What's you change that not to I'm a mama, see, I'm a see, you change that not You are the Lord. Yes, sir, he's here, he's here, he's here. Do you want the Lord? He dig out my way. You are the Lord. Lock up, I am a man. Heaven will pass. You change that not here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up, I am a man. What's similar? They got to you change that not here. You are the Lord. I am a man. Never run stride. Hey, nah, nah, you are the Lord. I, are you change it or not? You change it or not? Yeah. Ah, papa, yeah, but I say you change it or not? It ain't got my way. Lock up, yeah, but you know they play why you you change it or not? Yeah. Ah, yeah, No shadow of turning. You change it or not? Ah, nah, 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 nah. You are a steady God. You change it or not? Yeah. The same yesterday, today, and forevermore. Alpha and Omega, you change it not here. you change it not here. Lakaba, you change it not here. You change it not here. You change it not here. Ay ay ay. I like my day now. You change it not here. Ah, I like day you go. You change it not here. Ah, oh yeah, they make my 
remember you change it not yet. Yeah. You change it not you change it not yet. Yeah. I, 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 you change it not you change it not. Not yet. Yeah. Oh, you change and not yet. Yeah. Oh, I could not remember. You change and not yet. Oh, I do remember to that. You change and not yet. Oh, I will never make you change and not yet. Shut up. Time will never make you change and not yet. Do you change it now? Do you change it now? Do you change it now? You change it now? Do 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 you change it now? you change it now? Do you change you I can't I say man they change but to you we never change you I say I may change but to you we never change you I say government will change but you will never change The beginning and the end you change it now You change it not you change it not in you change and not delay. Oh, that change and not. Oh, you change and not delay. Oh, that change and not. Impossibility specialist, I had a day. Oh, that change and not. I said, supernatural strategist, any day. Oh, that change and not. They move you change and not. You change and not. Oh, that change and not. I say, you change and not. You change and not. I say you change it not, you change it not. I say you change it not, you change it. Ananana, one more time. I say you change it not, you change it not. You are the Lord. Come on, somebody give me praise. Aya kamba la dahazia. Nene mende brete bando sita baya. Le babande breke dombra atasata. Yanani sopaya. Ilaha soma andi anada. Holy Ghost. Unchangeable God. Unchangeable God. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get some direction here. I'm chasing after you. Should we stay? <laughs> Hallelujah to Jesus. Come on, somebody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, you can clap your hands like this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hey, one more time. Do that again. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, I'm chasing, say, I'm chasing after you. No matter what I have to do, I need you. I need you. More and more. more and
today there is a melody in my heart today today there is a melody in my heart come and say today 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 there is a melody in my heart today Lord in my heart He has given me victory There is a melody in my heart Today 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 I love you. There is a melody in my heart I say today 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 There is a melody, is a melody in, in my heart We will just say You alone You alone You alone Oh no 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 You alone You are worthy Come shine, you alone are worthy. You alone, you alone are worthy. You alone are worthy. Then you alone are worthy. He is in control. He's in full control. Master Jesus, he's in control. He's in control. He's in full control. Master Jesus, he's in control. He's in control. All over the world. Master Jesus, he's in control, say. He's in control. Ay, ay, ay. He's in full control. Ay, ay, ay. Master Jesus, he's uh -huh. in control. Atawale, atawale tu, atuwa yesu, atawale say. Atawale, atawale tu, atuwa yesu, atawale. He's in control, he's in full control. Master Jesus, he's in control, sir. He's in control. He's Are you with me? Control. Master Jesus, ah. he's in control. Listen, we thank you, 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 everybody. Say, we, we thank, thank you, we 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 thank you. Somebody give Jesus a shout of praise. For us the deep and dead for the word of soul, my soul, monkey, so you, you alone at my heart, desire and the Lord to worship you as the deep as the deep and dead for the word and soul my soul long get out
of our heart be accepted in Jesus holy and the magnificent name we have worshipped amen. amen what a day what an awesome moment of worship I know you are already saturated in his presence and his glory and you are ready hallelujah oh thank you father we love you, Lord. We do love you, Lord. You are everything we need and will ever need. Staying in your presence is the best satisfaction we can have. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Appreciate you, you ministers of God that have ushered us into his presence. What a moment. What a moment. What a moment. We can't trade in this with anything. That's what it's all about. Glory to God. Saints of God, I want to bring a little reminder to us this time, this moment. And I want you to please pay attention as a kingdom builder, as a God chaser, as a God lover. I want to bring something that our master Jesus said to us. And I want us to remind ourselves and renew our cogitations through this word and let it minister to you as it's ministered to me and it's going to also minister to me as I'm ministering to you. Just tell somebody now. Share with somebody. Ask them to come into this service to hear what God is saying to his church. Share as many times as you can. There's no error in that because you reach as many people as possible. I want to read from the book of Luke chapter 19 verse 12. Since of God is a very short passage from the word of God but it's going to speak really volume to us. Luke Chapter 19, verse 12. The word of the Lord said, Therefore, he said, Jesus talking, A certain noble man went into a far country to receive for himself a kingdom and to return. Yeah. And verse 30 said, And he called his ten servants and delivered unto them ten pounds and said unto them, Occupy till I come. Look at that word again. 
occupy till I come. There are two words I want you to pay very close attention to. Number one, occupy. The number two, till I come. In another translation, it said, do business till I come. Do business till I come. Right away, without any further controversy, without further explanation, you know now that Jesus, the living son of God, the incarnate of God, hates laziness. Whether spiritual or natural. Do business. Walk till I come. The only expiration debt to this business is death. I've said everything I wanted to preach. Then let's go. The Bible says he called ten of his servants. Whenever you see the word ten, it means complete. The fullness of. The accepted. The Bible says in the book of Ephesians chapter 1 that we are accepted in the beloved. So everyone that is called into this kingdom is of the ten. Everyone that have received Jesus as your Lord and personal Savior and the one that are about to receive him, you are among the ten. He called completely those that needs to be called and he pronounced an assignment, do business because I'm coming back. My God, this is enough to keep somebody on their toes. Sense of God, look at this. To occupy, in another words, means be in a place of trading. Keep trading. Trade on something till I come. But in this place, he was talking about trading kingdom business till I come. Carry on my assignment. Carry on my business. So Jesus has a business. In the book of John chapter 4, he made mention of his business. He said, my business is to do the will of him that sent me, the will of my father, and to finish it. So now, if you know Jesus' business, it's the same business he has given to us to expand his kingdom, to refurbish his kingdom, to sell his kingdom. I, I love this one. To sell his kingdom. To trade his kingdom. Because the kingdom of Jehovah himself. Given to us. Is the biggest trading platform. That heaven and earth can ever produce. I'm going somewhere with this. Stay with me. The kingdom we have called into. Is called the kingdom of the diligence. The kingdom of the diligent. It's not. The kingdom for hit and miss. It's not the kingdom of those who fold their hands. It's not the kingdom of those who sit on their gift. No. It's the kingdom of workers. It's the kingdom of doers. It's the kingdom of traders. You've been hearing me saying trading, trading. I'm going to show you what the trading is. It is going to really change your philosophy. God, hear me. The kingdom that we are called into... It's a kingdom of diligence and can only be promoted through diligence by diligent people. Those who are not diligent are actually abusing the kingdom assignment. I know you're sitting with somebody or you're sitting at home, wherever you're watching. If you have somebody around you, say, don't abuse this kingdom. The, the, this, this, the, you got to tell somebody. Say, the kingdom cannot be operated through people who cannot be depended on? One of the qualities of a good trader is availability. When the duty calls, I am available. If they are not available, they cannot produce. If people are not available, they can't even hear. If they are not available, they can't even know how to handle something. There is a difference between receiving something from the original owner and handing it over to other ones. So when you come to the original owner, the, what you receive from the original is different from what is handed to you. So the kingdom we receive, we receive something from the original owner. It has nothing to do with your feeling. No. We do this business bleeding. We do this business crying. We do this business creeping. Even if you 
fall, keep crawling, keep doing the business. There is no excuse whatsoever why you cannot do the business. Because you're not happy, come on, keep doing the business. It got nothing to do with your business. Actually, in the business, you restore your happiness. In the business, your joy comes. When you fall in the business, you can arise. In your business, you can defend your enemies. Those who sit on the fence are always falling out of the fence. You better get ready to run with a baton. Jesus gave us a baton. Say, do business, I'm coming. Hey, glory to God. Kingdom assignment is life and death. Watch this. He said, do it till I come. I'm going to be saying this over till I come because I'm going to show you something powerful. In, to do this business, we don't murmur. No matter what comes out of it because the one we are doing it for, we don't see him. We only sense him and we know him. No complaint because you're drafted in an unusual business. In this business, we don't look back. The Bible says, he that puts his hand to this plow, to the trading platform and look back, is not fit for this kingdom. This kingdom is not for back lookers. It's for onward lookers. This battle we are in, drafted into this army, it's not for fable. It's for men and women of tested strength. It's those who have been beaten on every side, but they carry the same mark. Because when we meet him, when he returns face to face, there is only one thing that will show the same identity with us and him, stripes. When he shows you his wound, you show him your own wound. If you've not been wounded for this business, you're not like him. If you have not been treaded, if you have not been betrayed, you are not like him. If you have not been battered, if your name has not been used for any kind of thing, you are still not like him. In this business, Satan will come against you in any form. He will call you a name that, are not, that is not your name. He will raise men and women to put you down, to betray you, to batter you, to do things to you. But it's in this place, uh, he is saying, you look like me, you act like me. There is victory in you through the story storm victory, through the falling and rising victory, through tears that is victory, through hunger days that is victory, even if the, storm, the, the roof of your ceiling is hitting, but still there is victory you will go through rivers, there will be victory, you will go through the fire but there is still victory, he's telling you stay on, stay on you have a cloud of witnesses that are clapping their hands and say come on, do this business come on, do this business the time is coming, because because your reward is amazing. Amen. Needs will arise doing this business. Don't put your need above this assignment. Don't. Don't put anything. Sometimes your body will be so weak, you don't even feel like saying good morning. But keep doing this work. This work came to us through blood. This is a bloody business. It's not an easy task. It came through death. This is a deadly business. But the thing is this. The one that has given us assignment is greater than all. For the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. He owns everything. He has the power to do anything. Because you may ask me, Pastor, Doing this business, what about my need? How can I take? Can, have you ever seen a diligent businessman go hungry? No, they don't go hungry. They don't suffer. Diligent businessmen are the ones that prosper. Lazy business people are the ones that suffer. So in this kingdom, lazy people suffer. They are very need-oriented. They are very beggarly. Give me this, give me that. But diligent people, the Lord meet. He meets their need at every point in time. When you're diligent on this business, even what you don't ask for, he gives it to you. Amen. He says, seek you first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all 
other things shall be added unto you. Matthew 6, 33. He said, say, when you do that, these are the things, the remnant, the food, the shelter, that's what the, the Gentiles are seeking after. They stop seeking that. Seek this assignment that I give to you. And all other things that the men and women are running after will come to you. Which tells me this. Those who abandon the business are not a part of his provisional plan. They, they are like the Gentiles scrambling for what they can get. But those who are in this business are part of his plans to provide. Can I say something to you? There's never been a man whom God is their provider that suffer. No woman, no boy, no girl. The strength of Jacob cannot fail. The glory and the lifter of her head cannot disappoint. The lily of the valley must always be beautiful. Yes, the bright and morning star must always shine. The way maker must always make a way. Oh, God. I, I'm telling you, the, the, the provider will always bake bread and fish when you need them. Amen. He did it when the disciples were stranded. He asked them, children, do you have bread? How can we beg bread coming to fish? He made provisions when they don't have. I don't care how far you have been toiling, just do business. You will see your toiling will be your profit. I, I wish I could talk to somebody right now. J J Jesus, uh, Jesus was talking. He, he, he said, do not be carried away what everybody is carried away. Be carried away. Let your mind be on my business. Whatever can make this kingdom work. Lord, this is who I am. Trust me. Call me. I have a day. I have a time in a day that I've set apart. In my prayers, nothing of me but thy work. Even if you don't know, call your pastor, wherever you are. Say, give me prayer assignments that I'll be praying on a daily basis. Tell me what to do that this kingdom will be going if the Lord, it is in that place you receive what is called intricate assignments. It is in that place you hear what is called silent voice to do what you cannot do naturally. Says of God, we don't worship from afar. It's in the close place of this business that something happens. I want to share something with you because time, time, time is running. Let, let me say something to you. Jesus said something in the book of uh, uh, John chapter 4, 35. Do you not say there are still four months and then comes the harvest? The Bible says, Behold, I say to you, lift up your eyes and look at the fields, for they are ready, ready for harvest. Nobody will tell me that I'm waiting for the perfect time. This is the most perfect time. This, any time you wake up, it's time to do business. If you're not going, you're calling them from your secret place. The Bible says, he who reaps, receives wages. Glory to God. And gathers full fruit of eternal life. But he who sows and he who reaps may rejoice together. What does that mean? I may be in my secret place. Say, Abba Father, send laborers to those person. Send laborers to those. We're calling in sinners. We're calling our souls. And somebody goes out to minister a soul and the soul get repented. You praying and the one walking, the same repent. Because if you don't pray, their heart will not be tilled. When you're praying, God will lead somebody to somebody who is in need of Christ. But for few in the heavens, God is the one who takes the record. Nobody knows what you that you're praying, but God knows. He sends his check to God. Because you are laboring. You may ask me, you know, there is for every trade, what is the currency of our trading? The currency of our trading is called power. We trade power for power. Jesus said, behold, I give you power over serpents and scorpions and over all the power of the enemy. And nothing shall by any means do what hurt you. Our faith produces power. Knowledge produces power. Our worship produces power. Our giving produces power. Everything power. Jesus said, tarry in Jerusalem. The Bible says, and you shall receive power 
after the Holy Ghost has come upon you. Two things you do with power. Power to disengage and power to engage. It takes power to call things into being. It takes power to stop things that are operating, not to operate. It takes power to tell the devil, take your hands off this kingdom business because we are at work. The Bible says concerning Nehemiah, in the book of Nehemiah chapter 4, they were building with one hand and they had the sword in the other hand. Which means while we are working, we are fighting. Sense of God, the power of God is what we use in trading. It takes power to convict a sinner to come back to the Lord because you are disarming the power of darkness that are held and bound. The Bible says Say in the gospel we are preached, the eyes of the end of the of the evil of the of the unbelievers are blinded because they are blinded because Satan has blinded your eyes. Nobody in their right mind want to take a gun and kill another person. It's satanic induced. Sense of God, you receive power, trade, trade, go do business. You have received the power, go do the business. You have received. The Holy Ghost, then go do business. The Holy Ghost is not just for us to speak in tongues and gladden it. It's for walk the work of him that called us. This is the moment. The harvest is, I mean, there is no time the harvest is ripe than now. The world is in tumult. No government has the answer, but we got the answer. The only answer to the world's critical situation is Jesus. Therefore, Hey, brother, sister, family, government, school, wherever you are, I give you Jesus. And this name alone is the glory and the lifter of your head. It's the one that will set you free from every bondage. I came to trade power for power. That power that is holding you not to answer the call. I command it destroyed right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Says of God. Do not let the work of God suffer when you're still alive. Don't. If the Lord has blessed you, he blessed you to expand his covenant. If the Lord has strengthened you, the word, you are a talker, that's good. Whatever he has given to you, every gift you carry, convert it to power and do the work. Because see, 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 <laughs> see, see. When the work of God suffers, when you're still alive, is an abuse to your redemptive responsibility. And don't let it be so. Occupy till I come. Take dominion. Take charge. Look at, look at this. Look at this. Jesus says something very profound. He said, John 4, 34. He said, my food is to do the will of him who sent me and to finish his work. And that's what we got to do. We got to finish this work. He cast out devil. We cast out the devil. We bring healing to the sick world. We bring deliverance to the world. We bring safety to the world. We bring everything that Jesus has produced. Is what we are taking to the world. Because they do not know what to do. That's an assignment for us. I tell every believer, your first assignment is to start praying. For the commission God has given to you. From there, every other thing comes. Be available and be responsible. God will make you a signet of his glory. See, 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 see. I want to read something because I'm concluding now. In the book of Revelation, chapter 21. Actually, I got to do 22. This scripture is what every believer needs to glance once in a while to put ourselves in check. The word of the Lord says something powerful. Verse 11. Revelation 22, 11 and 12 and 13. He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. He that is filthy, let him be filthy still. He that is righteous, let him be righteous still. And he that is holy, let him be holy still. Whatever you have chosen to place yourself, you have a choice. Either to do business or to walk away. Jesus said, if you choose to, why not do it diligently? If you choose not to, walk away dishonorably. But see, and behold, I come quickly. My God. 
And my reward is with me. To give every man according to his work shall be. I am Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end. The first and the last. Whatever you choose to do, do. But I will pay you what you have done. This is enough to know. Occupy till I come because I'm coming. Says of God, there is nothing under this earth that can hold us back from occupying this place. I don't want to be caught, lazy, sleeping, like the foolish five virgins, when the time to light up the light is come because the bridegroom is coming. Everything under heaven is speaking that Jesus is about to return. Every prophecy about his return has almost been accomplished. God <laughs> has used the wisdom of man to expand the gospel to every nation. There is no nation that I've not heard about Jesus because of internet and the media is going through globally. So now what is an excuse to mankind? What are we waiting for? The Bible says don't think it is four months. Don't think that there is still time. Now enter into the field. If you have not been walking, enter right now and say what will I do for you when Saul of Tarsus was arrested in an act of apostle chapter 9. The first question is that Jesus, who are you? Second one is, what will I do for you? What will I do? What do you have me do for you? Church, you need a big reward. You got to get ready to do some big work. The Lord is in need of you. The word of the Lord says he has given to every man a measure of grace. There's a measure of power is given to us a measure of grace. Keep talking. This kingdom shall not fall in my hand. This work will not fall in my hands. No matter where you are, no matter the church you belong to, you are a blessing. You are planted to walk the walk. It's time. One, two, three, we'll come together with that pastor knowing, getting on our knees and start calling on God. Revive us again. Send forth your rent. Send forth laborers. People will be calling in the night, in the day. You don't even know, need somebody to know what you're doing. You need to sit down and say, Father, you have blessed me. What will I do for you? How can I use the resources to give it to me to expand the work? How can we get back every airwave, every network possible to release the gospel to other part of the world? Knowing one thing, we will reap here on earth and in glory we will reap. And if Jesus tarries, your generation will not suffer. Amen. Occupy till I come, Jesus said. Do business. Do my business. I'm coming. Brother, sister, I've just shared my heart with you of the Lord is saying, let's do business. Church is no more church as usual. It's now kingdom affairs. It's time for you to come. Ask yourself. What will I tell Jesus when I meet him face to face? What about if he calls you home now? How will you meet him? A songwriter wrote a song, Must I meet him an empty handed? Not even without a soul to give. You can reach out. To preach, to lead people, compel them to come by the power of the Holy Ghost. You can pray for souls until they start finding their way. You can use your resources to give that the gospel will keep going further, that we reach it, men and women. There are too many things to do in this vineyard. Walk, walk, walk. There is a payday coming. For some of you, I already see your payday has come. Amen. You've been laboring, you've been working. You've been occupying your territory. I want to stand to tell that devil concerning you that is already taking your place. Doing everything necessary to create joy in the kingdom. Every devil in hell disturbing your move. Every secret plot against your work. Today, today, they must fare headlock in the name of Jesus.
everything that will not let you do God's work. Everything that will not let you lift up your head. I stand as God's messenger. By the fire of the Holy Ghost to cut off your living right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Whatever is tapping into your strength. Whatever is causing you to procrastinate. I judge them by the judgment of God. Whatever is keeping you sleepy slumbering in the time of prayer. I pull them off. Arise and shine for your light has come. And the glory of God is risen. This is our glory day. This is our glory day. For you that have been laboring, keep laboring. Expand your horizon, expand your territory. The Lord is already smiling for the good things you're doing. Do not be weary in good works. For you will reap if you faint not. Don't let anyone discourage you and talk you out. Close your ears. For this labor, for this business is not for side talkers. It's for onlookers. Look forward. There's a greater height. Malako Pragadia. Let's sing this song together. I'm pressing on the upward way. New heights I'm getting. Gaining every day, but keep pressing on the onward path. Lord, plant my feet on high your ground. Oh, love. So that I have found, oh Lord, Lord, plant my feet on a high, high hey. Pick it up. Now lift me up. Lift me up. And let me stand. Come on. My feet on I can hear my Savior calling. I can hear my Savior calling. I can hear my Savior calling. I go with you, with all the way. The way. Where he leads, where he leads me, I will follow. Where he leads me, I will follow. Where he leads me, I will follow. I'll go with him. On the way. You've been sitting on the side not doing anything and you think it doesn't matter it matters it's all about your life now how many of you will say Lord I want you to use me I want you to use me I want to touch lives I want you to use me to impart kingdom Wherever you are, I just want your church to say, Lord, use me. Just a simple prayer. Use me. Use me. I'm available. Whatever it takes, I'm willing to take this kingdom and run with it. The kingdom message. That Jesus died for those who have strayed. 
He shed his blood to redeem us. He ascended into heaven and is coming back again. That's all we got to share. And his blood can wash even the greatest and most wicked sinner to be clean. Let's run. It's power work. He has given you and he will give you power. Let me say this. If you're living within this metropolitan in Washington area where we are, and you want to be trained to walk, we have a way of training workers and causing them to be available. All you got to do, write us. Emboss us. I have a desire to work for God. We will help you walk with him. And as you do this, heaven's best treasures will be yours and your families in the name of Jesus. Amen. Another way to do this after this service, share with somebody. You will now be the one preaching the message. Tell them we got to do this work. Occupy till I come. And before we close this broadcast, I want to give you an opportunity to sow into God's work. For those of you of this congregation or want to be a part of this congregation, follow the information on the screen. You can tithe. We're asking you, your tithe, your offering. Uh, your, I mean, just as the Lord leads you. But you know what a tithe is. The tent of all your blessings belongs to God. <laughs> when you are available to give what you have, you're telling God, I'm available to receive what you have for me. There is no room for stinginess in this kingdom because God gave his best for you that you might enjoy the best. Release your tithe, your offering. And I pray God's riches, blessings, and his treasures upon you, your family, and everything you do. And from now I declare you are out totally from every financial struggle. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will prosper and profit in him. Tonight by 10 p.m. we'll be having a crossover service. Tonight by 10 p.m. 31st of October. 10 p.m. we'll be having a crossover service. I'm telling you, in, in here in America, they will be going out to cast a spell and deal with evil spirit, the dead spirit and everything. We will be doing a trading, taking away the spirit of death and releasing the spirit of life. Yeah. We will be doing something in the realm of the spirit. We will be quenching territories. We will be on a warfare declaring some things. I don't care the spirit of the evil or the dead or satanic power targeting your dwelling place. They will not find you. Amen. The information to log in, our Zoom information is on the screen. Just log in by 10 p.m. You will hear believers praying, talking. We will stand on our ground to tell the devil God has given us this land. You cannot take it. You won't. It belongs to us. Every blessing that God has blessed you, the enemy is targeting. The things you've been chasing, the things you've been digging after this crossover, they will literally be running to you. Because whatever be the hand of the enemy holding your blessing will be shattered. I bless you with the blessings of God. I release you for increase, for promotion. I speak to your body, receive strength right now. I speak to your bones, your marrow. I speak to your blood, be purified right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. I declare there is no weapon form or fashion against you. It will not prosper. Every thong that rises against you in judgment, we condemn it right now. You are of the bless of the Lord and you will live in blessings. In the name of Jesus. I just want us to praise out in praise and thanksgiving who has brought us from the beginning of the month to this time. Can you just raise a song service? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come, come, come on. Return, just come back. Libra Namasute. Yeah, yeah. Yes, sir. Come, come and worship. Let, let, let just let just end this broadcast with with a hilarious praise. I just want to just 
Wherever you are, as you begin to dance now, things will begin to happen in your life, in your family. Hallelujah. As you begin to dance now, begin to worship, I see powers and thrones being dethroned in the mighty name of Jesus. You have a song, you have something, begin to release it. I'm not the one to do it. As soon as you start, I'm going to get out, but I'm going to stay here and see what is happening. Who can battle with the Lord? Asha Tabakuti Yasa. Who can battle with the Lord? Sing it with impunity. Who can battle with the Lord? I, I say, say no. Oh, hey, Rima Surya Babato. Hela Manaso. Who can battle with Jehovah? No. Who can battle with Alpha? Who, Who can battle with the Lord? Lord? I say no. Body. I say no. I say nobody. When I name him, I nobody. I say nobody. I say no power. I say nobody. All right now. Ten, 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 ten. Ah, it's a gem. Aha. Seven, seven, eight. Ah, yeah, yeah. Aha. Hey. Who come back to win the Lord? Who come back to win the Lord? Who come back to win your name? I say nobody. Who come back to with you? Who come back to with the Lord? Who come back to with the Lord? I say nobody. Who can stand against your name? Who come back to with your name? Who come back to with the Lord? I say nobody. Who can challenge your power? Who can challenge your authority? Who come back to with the Lord? I say nobody. I say nobody. I say nobody. Na 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 no. Let's say, my man, no, nobody. I say, nobody. No power, nobody. In heaven and on earth, nobody. I say, nobody. Under the earth, nobody. I say, In the water, nobody. I say, 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 nobody. I say nobody. I say nobody. Who can challenge you, nobody? I say nobody. I say nobody. I say nobody. I say nobody. Nobody, nobody, nobody can challenge your authority. Nobody can fight your battle. Nobody will close when you open it. Nobody will open when you close. Say no when you say yes. I say nobody. 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 Come on. I say nobody. Come on. I say nobody. Fire. Seven. Seven. Chama me, 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 chama me